The Indian Air Force chief has said that the Tejas Mark II will be the backbone of the Air Force and it is going to be inducted in big numbers. The Indian Air Force has committed to procure six squadrons of Tejas Mark II, which is 106 units, but latest media reports indicate that the Indian Air Force might go for a total of 10 squadrons, which means that 180 Tejas Mark II fighters will be ordered. The indigenous content in the Tejas Mark II would be around 80 to 85 percent, which is significantly higher than 62 percent in the Tejas Mark I-A. The DRDO is confident that the flight testing of the Tejas Mark II will be completed by 2027, as all initial Tejas Mark II pre-production aircraft will be in final operational clearance standard, that will help to complete developmental trials in less than four years from the time of first flight. Most of the developmental trials will be to validate many of the flight regimes of the aircraft in the first two years, and then move into weapons testing for the next two years. The Indian Air Force has started receiving the limited series produced light combat helicopter from Hindustan Aeronautics, and the Indian Air Force will raise its first squadron of light combat helicopters in October. The Air Force will be getting 10 light combat helicopters from the limited series production lot, and after evaluating the limited series helicopters, the Indian Air Force will procure 65 more units. Bharat Dynamics Limited has started production of the two interceptor missiles that are part of BMD Phase 1, and it will be operational from 2023 onwards. The fabrication of the AD-1 and AD-2 next-generation interceptor missiles of BMD Phase 2 is also underway, which will be able to take down hostile ballistic missiles over a range of 1,500 km and 3,000 km. India will also use space-based surveillance systems to detect hostile ballistic missiles, even before the long-range tracking radars can detect the threat. The chairman of Cochin Shipyard Limited has said that the shipyard is keen to start work on a second aircraft carrier, for which it has the required trained manpower and over 500 micro small and medium enterprises that can deliver a 65,000 ton aircraft carrier in eight years. The Navy vice chief has said that an indigenous ecosystem has been created by building the weak grant, and the stage is set to take the next step forward to indigenously build the next aircraft carrier to ensure that the expertise gained is utilized to the maximum. The Indian Air Force took part in multiple missions with the participating air forces in the first phase of exercise Pitch Black 2022 in Australia. In the second week of exercise Pitch Black, Su-30 fighter jet of the Indian Air Force and Eurofighter Typhoon of German Air Force flew together. The three-week-long exercise Pitch Black features a range of realistic simulated threats, which can be found in a modern battle space environment. The ISRO has successfully demonstrated the inflatable aerodynamic decelerator in a Rohini sounding rocket, which is a game-changer with multiple applications for future missions including to Mars and Venus. The inflatable aerodynamic decelerator has huge potential in variety of space applications, like recovery of spent stages of rocket, for landing payloads onto Mars or Venus, and in making space habitat for human space flight missions.